when you're designing your project, you can create images using multiple uh, methods, including doing your own drawings and then scanning those in. What's a school photocopier? Uh, how to do that will be covered in another video. So it could be heavy outlines like this one. Finer details still going to work. Or you could even do solid objects like this and they can be import, scanned and imported in as well. Alternatively, you can search online for images uh, and JPEG seem to work the best. Simple outline drawings like this card might do an image search. Robots colouring on pages, that works really well. And then you do a little bit of manipulation. Or you can find images that are grayscale and we can actually engrave those using the laser cutter to have tone. So it can look similar to this but not nearly as much detail. You may have to crop that image to fit on your project or to just identify the parts you want. The other thing you can do is just draw solid objects using different programs, but paint seems to be the easiest when we're using Laser Web and then Blazor 2. And same with text. Do it in paint, import it, because when it's done in Illustrator, it doesn't seem to work as well. These are some of the outcomes. We have laser cut and a laser raster. Same different ways that we've uh, told D and Blazor 2 what to do and we've got different outcomes. That's laser cut and that's a raster. Different speeds, different powers, give a different effect. This one is done from a grayscale. The laser moves across at a set speed and automatically adjusts the power of the laser to create the tone. Now it's important when you design your project, if you're doing the frame, that you're careful with your layout. This is an example of a student frame and I just did a bit of testing to see what we could do. If you're going to put it in the corners, you have to make sure you sand your frame really well because if you don't sand it really well, that sort of thing, there's some glue there and it hasn't done the laser cut very well at all. So this frame here from a student, you can see some glue around here. If there was a laser cut to go in this corner, here it needs to be sanded really well, but consistently. Thanks for watching another video by Digital Dovetail. Like and subscribe.